make my list based on uh, sales, sales, critical acclaim, cultural impact, skill and ability, and lastly, yeah. discography. And we're going to see right. how these polls shape up at the end of the show. Okay. All right. We'll see how they shape up. And right, also, right, also, real quick, real quick. If you're enjoying this shit, like this shit, share this shit, sh- subscribe it. And when I say share, I mean, if you're enjoying this conversation, post this on your social media right now. Get your friends to come in here and get get involved in this conversation. Because yeah. we having Send fun. It to your friends, your family, they like music. Send yeah. Yeah. This ain't like a porn site that puts, like, why do, why do porn sites put social media links? Like, oh, I'm watching this, this woman get double penetrated. You know who would like this? My friends and family. Share. Like, why? Why? This, this, you can actually share with your friends and family. Look, we're not going to send no malware to your phone yeah. or your computer. You know, we might, uh, you know, we might send a little <laughs> bit of your personal information, but that's about it. Just a little bit. Just, just a little just bit. Enough. So, you know, we're not going to mess up your device. <laughs> yeah. Yeah, your device is fine. Yeah. Like, your family's device is maybe not, but you are fun. That's funny. That <laughs> like is you. funny. <laughs> <laughs> so share it, share it. But Hannibal, continue. I'm sorry, I didn't mean to cut right. you off. No, listen, let's let's just go ahead and get to my get to my pick because I, I don't know which one this is about to be, but I'm ready to talk about whoever it is. Oh yeah, the King of the South, Ti. Yeah. Yes, yes. Ti is on my list. T and I, the idea of people, and I know it's because his last couple projects have not resonated with people um, as much as some of his earlier work has, yeah. but like. T.I. in his prime was like, when he said that he was the king of the South, people was like, who is this dude? How dare he talk <laughs> about himself like he's the guy from, and then then showed everybody, oh no, I am that guy. Yeah. I am absolutely that guy. T.I., like, trap music had definitely existed. Like, whether or not he, like, he coined the term, you mm. know, I, I'm not sure, but he was definitely the person that popularized the term he is the reason that we that trap music the genre exists in the way that it does like he is one of the architects he is one of the founders of that job that sub genre of music him young jeezy gucci Mane, these guys along with uh bangladesh drummer boy zaytoven um and 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 shorty red i can't forget shorty red these guys were the architect of the modern trap movement. And to say that a subgenre of music got created in the early 2000s and still exists and has evolved to the state that it has now and, and, and is still going strong is phenomenal. Think about so many think about some of the subgenres of music. You remember the party like a rock star movement? Yeah. Oh, I love that. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, like you, you, you remember when they was trying to totally do like this, this like southern yeah. rap music with like tinges of rock in it? Or yeah. horrorcore? Or I'm trying to think of another subgenre of music. A cloud rap? Or uh what's another good uh what's another good subgenre of rap music? Um 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 uh, oh, I want to think of another one real fast. Yeah, like there are these so many subgenres of rap music that have come out over the years. Oh, the snot movement. You know what I'm saying? Cr- crunk music, right? Yeah. All of these subgenres of music came out either before trap music, during trap music, or after trap music, and none of those subgenres are still popular. Yep. But trap music is still very much popular, and that is almost ex- like like almost exclusively because of Clifford T.I. Harris. Yep. Yep. No, I, I ain't mad at you. Like, like yeah. I can list off my fa- The Libra, great. Dime Trap was great. Mm-hmm. Us or Else is my favorite project by him. Um, yeah. What else? Uh, Trouble Man, great. Paper mm-hmm. Trail, great. I, um, look, the, intro, the intro to the King album is fantastic. King! I, yes! King! I, great I, album I, by T.I. After Hurricane Katrina happened, uh, Ace Wonder and I were here in Atlanta. Uh, we were working for a record label that was distributed to Universal at the time. And we were at, we went to uh, Park Atlanta for some music thing that they were doing there. Like, I think it might have been like a talent show or something. And it was this, the day that T.I. released What You Know About That. Yeah. Mm. And yeah. I we watched this room of 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 teenagers, right, or like young adults, lose their fucking minds. Of they played that shit like a dozen times in a row, 
And and that shit bust. Also, the Ti's uh, original producer, uh, uh, DJ Toomp, uh, 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 a friend of mine, uh, extremely talented producer. He was the guy who produced What You Know About That. He sampled a, a, a Roberta Flex, a Donny Hathaway Roberta Flex song, and he took this one tiny chord change out of it. Right? This he replayed this one tiny piece of the beat, and it turned it into this fucking trap masterpiece. Yeah, Ti has the sales. He's got the critical acclaim. He's got the cultural impact. He's got the skill. He's got the ability. He's got the discography. That's why T.I.'s on my list. Yeah. Mm. No, I ain't mad at that. Yeah. And not for nothing, but for me to put a light-skinned dude on my list means that you got to be real nice. <laughs> That's racist. Yeah. yeah. I, listen, I don't like y'all. Y'all don't like y'all. Y'all don't like me. It's a good relationship. Y'all. Young, 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 not, not young, 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 Zoe. Them. Oh, okay. Yeah. <laughs> Young, yeah. young, young Zoe went to a jazz fest specifically to see T.I. one year because I couldn't go because I had to work. Mm-hmm. So she had other people take her. So Zoe's a T.I. fan. So. Yeah. And, and, mm-hmm. and, T, and T.I. also has multiple number ones. And uh, uh, Live Your Life from T.I. was yep. co-produced. It was, it was produced by Just Blaze and co-produced by a beat battle producer. Oh, really? Yeah. Okay. It was a, like Because I, I always wanted to be... The, the first beat battle producer to produce the number a, num, a top ten Billboard single and then yeah. he did it. <laughs> yeah. All his right. name is uh, the, the producer's name is uh, I think it's Sinai Finch uh, is his name. I don't know where he's from. I've heard a couple of joints he did. I've seen some of his beat battle stuff before. And yeah, that dude is incredible. And I'm glad that he was able to uh, to uh, uh, do that Live Your Life record because that was a huge record. That was such yeah such a big record. All right. Yeah. I didn't T- know that. King of the South. Yeah. No, no. T.I. T.I., that works. That works. Baby, I said Hannibal T. likes his beats down low, and he likes his hip-hop laid back. I, oh, you know what? I appreciate the tip <laughs> reference, baby. On. I wish we were still giving out plunger points, because I would give you some plunger points right now. Oh, we, we got something coming with the points. Like, yeah, yeah. Oh, we, yeah. And me also, and Hannibal got to finish got a, talking a, about a that idea. That, we got a super chat that came in a while ago that we did not acknowledge, and I want to okay. uh, from Kyron. Uh, uh, Arnold, it said Raskaz is a slept on goat. You are goddamn right. Yeah. Raskaz yep. does not get Resassination, fantastic project. Fan, just fantastic project. One of my, a uh, uh, matter of fact, uh, uh, Monty, one of the uh, ATL track monsters, uh, Be Ready, uh, has some joints that he did for uh, Raskaz. Really? All right. Yeah. Didn't know that. Yeah, nice. it's ATL, hey, listen, my, 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 I have a production entity called the ATL Track Monsters here in Atlanta, uh, and it is a team of monsters. Like they're like Track Monsters for real. Oh no, you no, know, they're shout, badass. Shout, yeah, oh. you know, shout out the whole team. Be ready, out of reach. Yeah. Uh, uh, Agent M, uh, Blacker than me. Yeah, I think you've uh, hit me up to, to work on Lance some shit Rich, for each low one. Low rated producer. Like, Hold yeah. on, I'm still naming niggas, man. Hold on, bro. Oh, I'm <laughs> sorry. I'm sorry. Say everybody's name. You know what I'm saying? Give them names. Give me up. I don't. I don't know who I left off now. I had to make sure I got everybody shout out. <laughs> you know. <laughs> But yeah, if he forgot right somebody, Asai, it's my fault. Joe. Yeah, low low rated producer Asaya Dio, Said Wines, Agent M, Blacker Than Me, uh, Out of Reach, Be Ready, uh, MVP Raz Rich, and of course, Team Captain Hannibal to beat him. Y'all 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 finished or y'all done? I ain't got no more talking. Sweet Halloween and collard greens. Y'all 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 finished or y'all done? I ain't got no more talking. Sweet Halloween and collard greens.